we have uh, presented for the first time a prospective randomized study comparing the mitra clip versus a control group in a population of heart failure patient uh, with uh, mitral valve regurgitation, secondary mitral valve regurgitation. And uh, the results are very interesting since we have seen that uh, the quality of the device uh, was good because the safety was uh, confirmed. We knew that from the different publication we had in some registries, but uh, we also confirmed that the clip is efficient at reducing the regurgitation, but, and this is interesting, but it has absolutely no impact on hard clinical outcome, that is to say, death for any cause or rehospitalization. And uh, our conclusion were consistent whatever the way we uh, took, we look at our results, intention to treat, per protocol, any subgroup analysis. So this is a conclusion who, which looks very strong. Having said that, our study has some limitation concerning the small group of the uh, of this study, we, we, so that uh, we cannot exclude that in some subgroup of patients the clip could be really efficient. This leaves room open for new prospective randomized study to assess small subgroup of patients who could be uh, st still be good indication. We cannot exclude that the patients who enrolled in our study were too thick. We have to go further. It's not the end of the story. We have to continue. The mitral valve is not the aortic valve. It's much more complex. And we have to better understand this valve before we continue these uh, uh, indications.